some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, I've got a very short video for you today in which a uh, sobtard from Georgia just doesn't seem to have a fully functioning brain. Oh my goodness, what else is new? So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's your name, sir? I am Moore. Moore? Oh yeah, Moore. That's short for, well, uh, I want more... Uh, lead-based crayons to munch on to continue to rot my brain with this sovtard nonsense. Am I right? To representation. Uh, I'm asking you. Your Honor, his name is Tyrese Breland. Breland? That's yes, not my name. A Breland. That's not my name. I am more, I'm here on special representation. I'm asking same, same as last uh, defendant, Your Honor. My honor, I'm asking okay. what is your status and what is your name? I'd like to know your name. I'd like to know your status. Of everyone in the courtroom, I would like to know what is your nationality and what is your... So, deputy. Yes, ma'am. I would like to know your so nationality. He has like charges in jots and he has a paper, paper like charge. Let me see if they're the same warrant. And they're different warrant numbers. Okay. So I guess I do both sets. It looks like they look. Let me see what these are. I like to know your nationality. I would like to know if you're uh, a U.S. citizen of the United States. And uh, uh, so, what is your uh, status? Thank you. You're a U.S. citizen of the United States. All right, hold on one moment, sir. Let me review the um, the warrant. Asking you for your status and the status of everyone in the courtroom. I would like to know your name. I would like to know the nationality. I would like to know, are you a U.S. citizen? Once again, I don't know. Is he deputy? Status so again, of everyone Ronald. in the courtroom. Is he injured? Is that why he in a, why is he in a wheelchair? Yes, ma'am. Well, I would say that this injury has uh, affected more than his uh, mobility. I'd say it's a really affected. His uh, brain, he doesn't seem to have a fully functioning one. Uh, you might want to go get yourself checked out to make sure that it's all there at the very least because, you know, they can declare you incompetent and uh, send you to the uh, sovereign citizen loony bin. And, uh, well, uh, yeah, you don't want to be there. There's a lot of nut jobs there. Uh, yeah, but you know what? I think you'll uh, fit right in. They have pizza every Friday, by the way. I would like to know the status of everybody in the courtroom. I would like to know your name. I would like to know your nationality. I would like to know what it, are you a U.S. citizen? Deputy, do you believe that this gentleman is mental health, or do you think it's just Thank a you. Can citizen? You provide me with the information. Both. Both. <laughs> yeah, I suppose he would be. I mean, he's just been talking in uh, nonsensical circles at this point and uh he probably really needs a psychological evaluation based on the fact that he's a more soft tart alone i mean uh these kinds of people just tend to be fairly incompetent when it comes to uh, interpreting the law and tend to be quite dangerous in uh, society for that matter considering all the uh more soft tarts who try to well off the police in the past few years i think it's hard to okay. Can you provide me with the information? All right, so I'm going to give you your charges. Charges for what? Are you a U.S. citizen? Are you a U.S. citizen? My honor, are you a U.S. citizen? Sir, be quiet. Are you a U.S. citizen? Yo, I said be stop. quiet. Are you Be a quiet. citizen? What is your name? What is your status? Hey. What is the status Yo, of everyone chill. in the courtroom? 
That's what I'm asking. All right. So y'all just go ahead and take him back. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and take him back. Y'all take him back. Yeah, move your feet. The uh, court to be, to be a jurisdiction of the court. Hey, you might want to talk. The court to be challenged. I'm challenging the jurisdiction of the court. I'm challenging the jurisdiction of the court because I am not going to say that. I am challenging the jurisdiction of the court. No, no, no. Everything is yes. challenged. I'm challenging the jurisdiction of the court. Hey, let me get two more talks like the rest of them. Let that know. I am challenging the jurisdiction of the court. Hey, Moore, can you even tell me the definition of jurisdiction? If not, then how can you even uh, challenge it, considering that uh, you are within the jurisdiction of the court to begin with? You committed the crimes in this part of Georgia, and therefore you get tried in this part of Georgia. It's as simple as that, you moron. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. You don't want to go to jail. For what? You read this. Yeah. I don't have to listen to read anything. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not listening. No, I'm, I'm not. No, I'm sexual oriented. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fucking leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. What's the Third Amendment? Most definitely. Because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. <clears throat> that sort of thing. Well, this is what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead, uh, per the um, the uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so, with that said, um, oh, I've got too many entities. I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name and date of birth. No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to. I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. Do you want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. He chose. Morning. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. Also. So, that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the supposed speed limit. Um, well, I didn't it, yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, but I said... That's a 25. 25. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. Hi, how are you? Okay, I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave, okay? Just, Why? I've been calling after you. You know you're not to be on campus. No. Put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys... You are now under arrest. You guys were arresting me for nothing. No. You know, you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. <laughs> Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want what, someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel 
because this channel has brought more good than negativity.